Often when we search a database for a specific topic, we tend to get a large number of results and that can sometimes be overwhelming. So for example, when I search World War II, you'll see that I get quite a few resources matching those terms. You've probably already seen how to filter these results by the different types of documents here at the top. But today we're going to take a look at how you can search within these results to narrow down your topic. So we have several different types of documents that are related to just our generic search term for World War II. But perhaps you're really looking for something on D-Day. So on the right, you'll see different ways to filter your results, including this search within button. So this allows you to type in additional information to help narrow your search. So let's just use D-Day as our search terms. And now you'll see we have much fewer results to sift through. This can really make the difference with our students on them just picking the first article they see versus actually finding the information they need.